In this lesson, we'll use the Surface Painter to replace some surfaces. And we'll place some 2D bitmap images to improve the following visualization. In the View Map, double-click on the entrance Detailed Shading View. Select the entrance stair. Then use the Orbit Mode to turn the building to a position where you can select the second external stair. Add the stair to the selection and open the Stair Selection Settings dialog. Go to the Finish, Tread Level. On the representation page of the Tread Component Settings panel, select Pavement Stones 10 as the tread surface. Click OK and hit Escape. Select all the railings. Open the Railing Selection Settings dialog. Choose the panel's hierarchy level on the 3D representation of the panel component settings panel. Set the glass soda lime tinted surface as the override panel surface. Click OK and deselect the railings. We'll use the surface painter palette so we don't waste any time. You can open this palette using the window, palettes, Surface Painter, or Document, Creative Imagining, Surface Painter, Menu Command. The Surface Painter palette allows you to override element surfaces very quickly and in a very natural manner. Make sure that the Suspended Groups function is off, and select all the retaining walls. In the right panel of the Surface Painter, you can see that these are elements applied to the stone limestone fine surface. Type the keyword Concrete05 in the search field at the top of the Surface Painter. Select the Concrete05 surface, then hover the cursor over the stone limestone fine surface, and click to override it. Hit Escape twice to deselect the surface and walls. Now select all three segments of the curved wall. Search for the stone limestone fine surface and use it to override the stucco yellow rough surface. Deselect the walls. In the surface painter, click on the pipette icon. Then click on any foundation wall to pick up its surface settings. As a result, the Concrete 02 surface will be selected in the surface list. Right click on this surface and activate the Select All Elements using the Concrete 02 context menu command. Override this surface with Concrete 05 and deselect the elements. Select all the beams and the roof. Set the wood oak dark surface instead of wood pine grained horizontal. Please note that you can change the preview image's size using the drop down menu in the top right corner of the left surface painter panel. For all windows, doors, and wood columns, apply the wood oak dark vertical surface. Don't forget to deselect the elements. Find the pavement cobblestone surface. Select it. And click on the top surface of the bottom level pavement slab. Replace the top level pavement slab top surface. 
and the ramp top surface with pavement stones 10. Finally, set the top mesh surface to grass 3D middle. And close the surface painter palette. 